Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading today so that we can look at the coming week and see how we want to plan our time and our activities. The first card is Keeper of Water, Wisdom. The second card is Four of Fire, Home. The third card is Six of Air, Meditation. The fourth card is Nurturer of Earth, Abundance. And the fifth card is Mystic of Earth, Frugality. So we're beginning our week with wisdom. This is information, knowledge that we've gained through experience. We know it to be true. We know how to replicate whatever comes from it. We know how to use this. Be in your wisdom at the beginning of the week, at all that draws you toward more love, more compassion, higher consciousness, greater connection and awareness. From wisdom, we move to home. So this tells me that we're taking our wisdom home. This isn't wisdom that we take out into the world and leave there and ignore it when we're at home. This is wisdom that we apply to our daily life with the people that we care about. From home, in the middle of the week, we move to meditation. So take some time in the middle of the week to be with yourself, come back to your center, and give space for your mind to expand a little bit on your own terms. From meditation, we move into abundance. And abundance is such a lovely place to be. It means that there's plenty of something. In this situation, I want you to choose your abundance by using your wisdom that you brought into the week with you. Do you want an abundance of unsharpened pencils? Do you want an abundance of money? Do you want an abundance of friendship or love? Do you want an abundance of adventure? Choose that and watch it manifest in your life. Now from abundance, at the end of the week, we move into frugality. While these might appear to be opposite each other, they truly aren't. Abundance says, I have plenty. Frugality says, I use it in ways that can serve what I have so that what I have lasts as long as I want it to. So in summary, begin your week with your wisdom and bring that wisdom home to you. Apply it to the people and the experiences in your everyday life. Take a little meditation break midweek Choose the abundance you, cho you want to experience and use that abundance from a long-term perspective rather than using it all right now, this minute. Make sure you have some to spread out. Have a wonderful week this week.